two, one, it is recording. So welcome guys to the tune up. Um, I ask you all to blitz out the link to this call to your friends, family, business partners, whatever the case may be. Um, and, and, and while you're at it, going to comments, going to chats, list your dream vehicle, right? List your dream vehicle, uh, list your affirmation, your I am, um, and, and really, uh, you know, just put some energy behind it because what we do on this call is we take your dreams and your um, your dreams, your goals, and we manifest them into the now, right? Uh, every time that I say goals, I say scored after it. It might not be literally out my mouth, but I say it somewhere in the universe. I say, you know, when I say goals, I say scores, you know, as long as it's healthy, positive, you know, and things of that nature, it's scored, you know? Um, so, you know, going to chat, just list your affirmations, your dream vehicle. What are you grateful for? I am grateful. I am thankful for each and every one of you. I am thankful for the opportunity to do this call every weekend, right? Today was a little late. I um, was moving out of my house in Jersey. It took a lot of time, um, a lot of memories, a lot of emotions, man. I was just thinking about everything, man. I, I really grew up in that house uh, for the most part. And and just to, you know, pack all my stuff and, and to leave, you know, for the second time, but this time is the final time. So I was just like, oh, I was looking at all the write-ins and uh, I have like a door that's just tagged up. And I'm like, I want to take the door, but then I'm like, you know, at the same time, um, I'm growing, right? I'm growing. I'm, I'm expanding. I'm, I'm shedding that house to bring in uh, new houses, right? Houses that's mine, houses that, you know, I'm the owner of, you know, houses, you know, and, and, and more blessings, right? More blessings, right? So, um, so my name is Marquise, right? I am from the East Coast of the United States. I have traveled abroad. I've traveled domestically. I'm doing way, way, way more traveling in the near future um, now and beyond. Um, it's really, really great to uh, have the opportunity to do this call, right? Um, I came up with this call because I'm like, you know, people really need um, or, or, or should have something that pushes them forward, right? Something that pushes them forward. And when they're low, something that pulls them up, right? The whole, uh, uh, um, the whole structure of this call is to make sure your higher highs is higher than your last high and your lower lows is higher than your last low, right? We aren't a bullish momentum. We aren't a bullish market. We're on a bullish trend, right? And, and we're dedicated to that. It's dedicated to us. And that's the great thing about this call. That's a great thing about this community. That's a great thing about this future and uh, this whole, uh, um, this whole, you know, greatness that's becoming greater. Right. Um, so that's uh, the reason for this call. Right. So today, uh, for those that was on yesterday's call. Uh, sorry, I had to take a sip of the smoothie on that one. That call was so great that literally I had to do a part two today. I had to do a part two today. This is the first part two that I ever did in the history of the tune up. Right. And the history of the tune up, this is the first part two that I had to do. Right. That episode was so great. Right. It was called Juvenate. Right. And today is Juvenate part two. Right. Juvenate part two. Right. So we're going to be juvenated. Right. So I have a question for all of you. Right. Literally. And, and I'm actually going to read uh, something before I get into my question. I am so happy and grateful to be on this call. Let's go. I am so happy and grateful that you're on this call. I am so happy, appreciative, and thankful that you're on this call. Like when I say grateful, I mean G R E A T, um, G R E A T F U L, right? Uh, not the G R A T, because one thing we have to program our paradigms, program our minds, program our, our, our thinking, our seeing, our being right is to really get out of the trickery get out of the system get out of the programming that they're programmed us to be less than anything because we're blissful we are the greatest species on earth right and probably the universe right we are the universe right we all have the universe in us the universe created us so how cannot how can we be as how can we not be as blissful as the universe right? We are that. We are of that. So that means we are that, you know? So, you know, when I say grateful, I mean G-R-E-A-T, 
great full you know not great like you're great in cheese like you're breaking something down like no i mean great like you're becoming better bro you're becoming better sis and you're gonna everly become better you will everly everly become greater you know so um yes 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 so um the question i have for you guys right i was thinking about something i was like you know uh because I got up today and I was kind of tired and my energy just literally started going down as soon as I like woke up and stuff. And I, and I noticed it and I was like, yo, hold up. Like I can't get, I won't, not that I can't, I won't get on this call draining people energy. I won't get on this call. Like I have to be, I want to be, I am energetic on every one of these calls right because the things that we're doing on this call the manifestations that is happening from this call on this call by this call oh my gosh people are hitting ranks people are blowing up in their businesses people are blowing up in their lives and when i say blowing up i mean literally blowing up like glowing up like they're glowing up like you know off this call so it's, it's, it's great. So, uh, you know, I took a couple extra minutes, maybe about 20, 30 minutes. I um, apologize uh, for that. And I appreciate you guys' patience, but I will not be a disservice to you guys uh, ever. Um, I will always be a great service and I will always provide the best service I can or best products that I can at all times, because that's what I committed to. That's what I'm de dedicated to. That's what I put out there for me to receive what I'm receiving, what's landing, what's I am, what I'm acquiring, what I already acquired. Um, so, yeah. So that's the reason for the delay of the episode. That's the that's the reason for the delay of the episode. So I appreciate you, right? And we appreciate appreciate it. So, um, like I said, I was I was literally waking up. I was going through all these things, and um, I was like, you know what? A lot of people right now is going through the new year, new me type of mentality, and I'm like. New me, you, new year, new me, right? And to, to be honest, last year ended very well, right? Bitcoin was skyrocketing. People were making money. People were flourishing. People were just moving around. It, like it ended very good, right? Even for people that, you know, didn't have the best holidays, right? Because myself, I really didn't have the best holidays this year, right? I haven't had the best holidays in, in a couple of years, right? And this year was kind of tragic for me. I apologize, the smoothie is just so good. <laughs> Listen, if you're not waking up with smoothies, you're doing yourself a disservice, man. Go to the store, get a frozen bag of blueberries, frozen bag of whatever, ever, uh, whatever other fruits you like. They're like $10 a bag. It will last you for like a week, even if you make them every day, because it's a big size bag, get like two or three of them. The more you get, you know, the less you use of each one of them. And, you know, the more it goes on. But listen, when I tell you this, right, I don't mean to be gross, but I do keep it real on this call, right? This ain't a raw and uncut call, but I do keep it real, right? So with that being said, listen, <laughs> when you go to the bathroom, you will thank yourself, okay? <laughs> Your body would thank you. Like literally you would just start evolving from the inside out, right? So with the new year, new me type of mentality, right? You literally tell yourself that it's a new year, so it's new you, right? But what happened if you ended the year strong, right? Just keep on going, bro. Just keep on going, sis. All that new year, new me stuff, it, it, it literally, it, 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 it's like a reset. And why reset on something that's going good? Why reset on something that's going great? Just be better, just be greater, right? How about a new, new, a new year, more dedication, a new year, more aspiration, a new year, more motivation, a new year, more, uh, you know, something like that, you know, something that's great, right? So yeah, change your paradigms on that, right? And, um, also, what I want to go over in this call, right? Start healing, guys, from the inside out, right? The system is there to program you guys to and program families and friends and things like that to call it quote unquote games, right? Games, right? 
where, you know, we toxify ourselves from the inside out and we call it fun, right? Whether we go into the bar, whether we, you know, going out for fast food or, you know, whatever. And we look at that, right? Our mental, our paradigm was, right? Was, cause not anymore, was programmed to think that this was great. This was your cheat day. This was your, you know, um, this was your day to, 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 you know, live your life, you know, YOLO, right? But you're literally toxifying yourself. You're breaking yourself down from the inside out. That's the worst type of hell to live through. That is the worst type of situation to be in, right? Right. How many times like it's so funny because I'm around pretty women all day. Right. I, I literally surround myself around a pretty women. Right. But some of the prettiest women have the ugliest souls and, and they don't even know because then they, they see my energy and then they're like, oh, what's wrong with him? And, da -da 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 -da. and and I literally have no ego. Like I have no ego, you know, but I do keep it real. And sometimes I just like, I curve them and they, 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 they just don't want they just don't know why. And it's like, it's your attitude, right? You can be the prettiest anything, right? But when you open your mouth or when you do something disgusting, then you're disgusting, right? When you move in a way that's not ladylike, that's disgusting, bro. When you move in a way that's narcissistic, that is disgusting, right? Because you got to think, how are you making others around you feel? How are you making your family feel? How are you making your inner self feel? Right? And literally, and, 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 and literally you're doing yourself a disservice, right? So with the whole new me, new you, right? Let's think of, of, of this, right? Let's take this in this and take in this analogy. This is not a paid promotion, but right now um, the NFL is going through this playoffs. Have that playoff mentality, right? Why reset yourself and start a new season if you haven't hit your goal yet? If you're not in the playoff, have that playoffs mentality. Right now, it is playoffs. We're going to the Super Bowl. Our Super Bowl is the championship, is the chairman championship, is the chairman, right? The chairwoman, that 10K a month, that 50K a month, that 100K a month, that 250K a month, that 500K a month, that 750K a month, right? That a thousand K a month, excuse me, uh, 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 excuse me, a million a month, right? That's the next rank that's going to be brought to this to, to, to our plan. I hope you guys know that. So if your visions is not there, you're doing yourself a disservice. If your vision isn't on Chairman 1K, you're doing yourself a disservice. That's $12 million a year residually. I was on a call last week. And on this call, one of the chairmen said he wanted to one of the events unranked. And this happened in a year, right? Unranked. Then pop 150. Went to the next event, 600. Went to the next event, 1K. And then literally hit chairman by the end of that year. Right? I had a, 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 a conversation with one of my mentors, Manny G. And we was talking about how fast it is, how fast it's possible for you to hit Chairman 750 in this business, right? Bryce Thompson went from P600 to Chairman 750 and I think it was two years. Maybe I'm being generous. It was probably like a year, a year and a half, right? Chairman 750, the youngest person to do it, right? Right, and you know how he did that? Running plays, calling audibles, and having that playoff mentality. Tell yourself at every standpoint, at every point in time, at every point that you're getting better. Constantly plant seeds into yourself, constantly plant seeds into others, right? A lot of people don't even know the blisses that I do for them, the seeds that I plant for them, right? They won't probably know until, you know, somebody just out of pocket, just do some out of pocket things. But literally, 
I plant seeds for everyone at every time. When you get on this call, a seed has been planted. You live in your greatest life, right? Your vibrations going from 50 to 100, from 100 to 200, right? Every call you get into, your energy is going to get higher. Your dreams is going to be scored. Your goals is going to be scored, right? I do this call every weekend. Every weekend I'm on this call, whether it's 9.30 or set for 9.30, whether I get on at 9 o'clock, 9.30, 10, I'm on this call. I'm on this call, right? So program yourself and, and change your paradigms, guys. That is the every, I know we hear it as cliche, it's paradigms, but I'm reading a book right now that um, literally I've been taking my time on the book because the book literally says you're going to get headaches, right? We attend to like, and, and it's intentionally. Like this is, it's a lot of knowledge in this book. And with that being said, I'm like, hey, I need that book. I want that book. I want to read that book. So I bought that book. Right, I bought that book and I'm reading it. And the more I read that book, the more I go through the book and the more I'm going to be giving to you guys. I literally uh, am so thankful and appreciative of you guys because you guys push me forward, right? I push you forward, right? I pull you forward, I push you forward, but you guys do the same for me, right? Just coming on these calls, just expecting another great episode, another aha moment, right? More and more and more and more of it the more and more and more I'm gonna go, right? And that's a lesson to all you queens out there, right? All you queens out there, the more you push, right? The more you want to do, the more you want to achieve, the more, you know, you have that boss like not too bougie, right? To at least to, you know, be, be personable. But, you know, the more you wanna go, the more you glowing up, the more you're going to make the men go up, glow up. The more you're going to push the men to go forward, right? But do it, you know, personally, you know, like do it, you know, be cute about it, right? And guys, the same way, the more and more you go, the more and more you bring your queen forward. You never leave your queen behind, never. The one thing that you can do wrong is leave your queen behind because then she's gonna feel left out, then she's gonna become needy, then she's gonna become greedy. And that's, you don't want that. <laughs> I'm just saying, you don't want that. Like, you really don't want that. So when 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 moving forward, when prospering, when, when becoming more and more juvenated, right? And when I say juvenated, I mean like charged. And I can say, right, someone asked me, oh, matter of fact, I take it to this standpoint. I I typed in the word juvenile and autocorrect popped up. It gave me the swiggly line, right? And, and this is just a, a thought, right? This is kind of a, a thought process and how I think at times, right? Why is it okay for rejuvenate to be a word, but it's not okay for juvenile to be a word? Why is it okay for good to be a word, but gooder not to be a word? Right? And this is sometimes, this is how I think, just like when, I, when I'm moving forward, because I use words that's not words. <laughs> I say it all the time, I'm gooder, right? I'm juvenated. Juvenated? What, what do that mean, juvenated? No, it means the same, you know, I just not like, because if I say rejuvenated, that means that I'm not juvenated, right? So can I be more juvenated, right? So have that mentality of you're right now in the playoffs. You're in the playoffs, right? You made it, bro. You made it, sis. You made it, queen. You made it, king. Like, let's go. Let's go. We here. The time is now, right? You are enough, right? A song that I always have playing is like that song when it be like, we ready, we ready, we ready, right? And, 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 and literally that's, have that mentality, 
right? Always be ready. Always be ready. You don't got to get ready because you ready. Right? All the extra is just extra. <laughs> you know what I mean? All the extra is just extra. Right? You fly without it. You great without it. But all the extra is just extra. You already ready. You already enough. So many times I'm looking at the queens, right? They waking up in the morning and literally like sometimes I just have to tell them at times, you know, and sometimes, you know, it's not my queen, but you know, I'm, I'm always giving compliments. I, I, that's one of the things that I, um, is, is, is my goals, right? Is my scores is to give compliments every day. And it doesn't make me a flirt. It doesn't mean that I'm for everybody. It doesn't make me a mixy. It doesn't make me any of that. It just makes me real, right? Because people need to know that you are enough. Like when you wake up in the morning, right? And you think that you ugly, you know, literally in a relationship, I'm single, but in a relationship, I love stink breath kisses. Early morning kisses, you get all of them. You get all of them. Even if I brush my, even if I already was up and brushed my teeth and did all that stuff, I'm giving you all of it. But Pat's all of that, right? And that's real stuff. Like that's real, that's just real rap. Like <laughs> to be totally honest, like you need to know that you're enough. You need to know in the morning when you wake up, your hair is all over the place, it's frizzy, it's curly, you know, it's nappy, whatever the case may be, you still look good. Like that makeup, that glow up, it's just that, it's a glow up, but you already glowing, right? When you wake up in the morning and you just, you know, feel like, huh, you know, whatever's going on with your body and stuff like that or whatever, you know, everything's all puffy. We looking at that, we like, dang, my bae cute. <laughs> you know? <laughs> and, and, and at times, you know, y'all be having attitudes and stuff, you know, we might do something stupid, like smack you on the butt or, you know, just do something dumb, you know? But that's just us telling you like, yo, I appreciate you. It's like puppy love, you know, right? Let's cheers to this. Let's cheers to this juvenation part two. Because literally, I'm juvenating y'all in every aspect, right? In every aspect. So literally, you get up in the morning, you get dressed, you know, on a normal day, let's call it a Monday, right? You get up, you go to, you know, you get dressed and stuff like that. You about to head to work. Your energy is at like, yeah, it's Monday. Let's say your energy is like at 80. Because most of us, right, once we get up and get moving, we feel great, right? It's just the thing of getting up and getting moving, right? But what it really is, is the first thing you tell yourself in the morning is I'm ready, right? I really don't pay attention to me, cartoons and stuff like that, because it'd be having hidden, hidden uh, messages and stuff like that. But I had that SpongeBob mentality. Wake up and I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> Seriously though, right? Have that mentality, right? Because the more you tell yourself you're ready, the more you're gonna be ready, <laughs> right? The more you tell yourself you're enough, the more you're gonna be enough. The more you're gonna be overflowing in enoughness, right? Not even enough at that time. It's not at that time, at that point, it's not even enough, right? You're just more than enough, right? And that's where appreciation comes in. When you feel like that, like right now, what I would say do, right? Is pat yourself on the back. Give yourself a hug, kiss your hand, you know, kiss your arm. Appreciate yourself right now, right? Because the more you appreciate that feeling, the more you will receive that feeling, right? So many people at times feel like they're below, feel like they have, like they're doing their self, their family, their system, their culture, a disservice for feeling like they're more than enough. But I'm gonna tell you right now, it's okay. It is okay, right? It is okay to feel like you're more than enough, bro. It's okay to feel like you're more than enough, sis. Right? It's, it's okay. 
you're good. You're secure. You're flowering. You're blossoming. Right? Love that. Be that. Embody that. You are that. Right, bro? Yes. Yes. And I'm not just talking to you guys. I'm talking to myself as well. Right? The most amazing thing is going back through these tune-up episodes, right, after I upload them, right? I haven't did it for like two weeks now, which I'm kind of lacking on, but maybe, you know, it's just me and my programming, right? Because literally at times, I'm so far in the future, I'm so far there. I program myself so much. I plant positive seeds so much that I just flow, right? I just flow and just trust myself, right? <laughs> trust the progress, right? A lot of people say, oh, trust the process. You know, me and um, one of my business partners, my sponsors, the queen, right? Um, I call her, uh, I told, we, it was so funny. I said this and she was like, oh, say that again. And she wrote it down, right? Uh, I said, a lot of people say, trust the process. I'm trusting the process. I'm trusting the progress. Trust the progress. Right? Trust the progress. Trust the progression. Trust your own progression. Right? Trust the progression. Like the process can be a process that's not for you, right? It could be the system. It could be whatever. Like a lot of people at a time, you know, they they you know, like I hear the chatters. I hear the chatters. Usually from people that don't understand or don't know me or, you know, I have a lot of speculations or don't trust me. And here's something for you guys, right? Trust is not earned, it is given, right? You should trust everyone until the trust is broken, right? Literally, 10 years ago, 20 years ago, we were told not to meet people from the internet, uh, don't talk to strangers. Don't get in a car with strangers. And what are we doing nowadays? We're on the internet, talking to strangers, getting in the car with strangers, right? Ubers, lifts. Shit, we even going further and getting our food delivered by strangers. That is so sketch to me. <laughs> that is so sketch to me. Like, to be totally honest, that is so sketch. Like, I'm not, you know... Please, I don't even trust a delivery man like that, tell you the truth. <laughs> like on anything. Like I'll be more happy when they put cameras in the in the bags. Like, you know, the pizza man, like put a camera in there with my food and I can track it that way. I don't want to track it from the app, see when it's coming out, you know, yeah, drinks and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't want to see when it's coming out the stove. No, I want to see the whole process. Like put a little, you know, GoPro on it and I can see the whole process. Like, for real, for real. <laughs> Happy I was never one of those guys, though. I used to have friends. I used to work in fast food, man. I used to just do disgusting stuff. And I used to look at them like, yo, bro, y'all, wow. I can't be like y'all. Like, <laughs> I ain't going to ruin none of y'all days, right? But it's cheaper to cook anyway, right? It's cheaper to cook. It's way more healthier to cook. You can put your attention on your food. You can clean your food how you want. I literally, I don't care what it is, vegetables, you know, I don't, I don't eat meat, um, I'm a vegetarian. But when I clean my vegetables and stuff like that, I put salt water, vinegar, and water, right? When I'm cooking them sometimes, most of the times I have salt water in it, especially in the veggies and stuff like that. Clean all that stuff that's been happening through the process of it's growing, right? That chicken, that meat, listen, oh my gosh, that's the biggest thing. Right, that's the biggest thing is putting that, like, you know, when I grew up, it was like, oh, you know, I used to eat meat. I used to eat, wake up every morning. I used to eat like five eggs, eight strips of bacon every morning, and probably like two or three pieces of bread. Right, I was big. Like right now, right now, I'm like, I, I'm, I'm still like, I'm keeping my weight, right? I lost weight, I broke my body down, right? Uh, I broke my, years ago, I broke my body all the way down. I'm talking about I was so skinny yesterday, cleaning out the house, I gave my uncle a pair of pants of mine. That was a 34 waist. Now, guys, you know how little that is. 
I'm six foot four and a half. Like <laughs> to be a 34 waist, literally, I felt like I couldn't defend my woman if I wanted to. At that time, I had a woman. I couldn't defend her if I wanted to. I remember one day I was so mad, the Uber driver was like pissing me off. I don't know, I think I was just going through a junior trip. Um, you know, I was smoking a lot of bud back then. And, uh, you know, when my high used to get blown, I used to get mad, <laughs> right? <sighs> very masculine, very protective, right? I was the only man, I was the man of the house. At that time I had my grandmother, great grandmother, a girlfriend. Um, in the house and things of that age. I was the man of the house. I was running the streets. I feel like I couldn't protect anything, right? So yeah. So um, yeah, so now I'm keeping my weight up and everything like that, right? But with uh, Ann, not but Ann, with that being said, you know, I was cooking chicken the other day, right? For a family member, for family members. And, you know, back in the day, they used to teach us to clean the chicken with the lime or the lemon, you know, and things of that nature. Man, vinegar, salt, and water. Listen, if you're new to this call, vinegar, salt, and water. Put it in your house, right? If you're having, you know, skin problems, you need to clean out skin problems like boils, pimples, things like that. The end of the night, you know, first thing in the morning, take some vinegar, some salt, right? Himalayan salt, sea salt. You know, um, anything but that umbrella salt. That umbrella salt gots to go. If y'all have that umbrella salt in your cabinets, literally take it right now and throw it out the window. Throw it out the door right now. That umbrella salt is so cancerous, it's so toxic. Take that and throw it out right now. Like, I'm not, like literally, I'll be okay with you walking into your kitchen right now and throwing that salt out Th right now. But yeah, you take the vinegar, salt, water um that and larry's right larry's too larry's all that season so anything catered to like you know uh black people or soul food toss it out <laughs> toss it out toss it out use that zone that's what you can use if you don't want it larry's is cool nah no it ain't use that zone that's what you do get some sazon right it's a little more healthier right <laughs> um but yeah, clean, you clean your energy with that. You clean your aura with that. Clean your food with that. Clean your body with that. Females, just be easy when it comes to your female parts, right? Um, the upper parts, you should be okay with as long as you're, uh, if you're not breastfeeding, something like that, because you don't want, you know, to get into, you know, um, the opening if you are breastfeeding um, or, you know, have milk or whatever the case may be. But you know, if not, you can take out the salt or you could dilute the whole thing, dilute it very, very well. Um, if you choose to use it on your feminine parts, I know people that take salt water vinegar baths. Um, so that's a really great thing to clean your energy, to clean your aura. Um, you can even go, go to kind of baptize yourself, right? Lay down in it, submerge yourself in the water um, and then come up like hold your breath and everything, right? And it cleans your whole energy, your whole aura, everything like that. It cleans it instantaneously, right? And that's a part of being juvenated, right? That's a part of being juvenated, just living that best life, feeling this good, right? And this energy is not going away. Like this energy is not going away. It's amplifying. It's becoming greater. It's becoming more healthier, right? Every call, this feeling is attached Every call, this feeling is attached, right? And getting better and better and better. Every call you get on, you just feel better and better and greater and greater and greater and greater and greater, and greater right? Because that was my intentions from the get-go. It was to give back, give back, right? And this is not me. Like, this is really just not me. Like, this is the universe. This is the gods, the goddesses that walk with me. That, 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 that is me, that, that whatever the case may be, but we here. This is not a facade. This is not, you know, one of the, uh, you know, one of the uh, simulations, right? And with that being said, right, guys, what you should start doing, right? I did it, you know, I'm doing it. Um, I started changing all that. Anything that I see that's a programming, I change it. I change it from the water coming into my house to the, to whatever, like I, I change it, I change it. 
the vibrations, the EMS, all that stuff literally gets, when it comes into my aura, it, it works for my benefits. I'm not beef for serving a system that, that, that's not serving me, regardless of what system it is. That's why I joined the academy. Because I know at every given time, I have products, I have services that's servicing me, right? I have an AI system that's servicing me, right? So yeah, man. So I just tell all each and every one of you to live great and greater and greater and greater and keep this energy high, right? Keep this energy high, right? Like that's what we are doing, like it's done already, right? We throughout the day, right? So let me get some feedback, let me get some commentations. Let me get, you know, we in momentum right now. Yeah, man, but this momentum, this right here is dedicated to us. It's dedicated to us. So let me get some feedback and things like that right now, uh, if, if you guys want. I appreciate you. Fire, fire, fire up. All right, cool, cool. Listen, so we're going to end this call here. I appreciate each and every one of you. I thank each and every one of you for getting on the call. I really, really appreciate you. Um, and I'm really, really thankful for you. Um, and my lawyers, I appreciate you guys. For the ones that hasn't been on, that haven't gotten on this call yet, but will, I appreciate you as well, right? Because this call is literally going to hit millions of views. Millions of views. These calls right now is going to dang near, like, blow this business crazy up, right? Not just my organization, you guys' organization, especially my lawyers, right? When we put those pots together, right? When we put those pots together, we're like, oh, this video just gained 10K. You know, I just got paid by YouTube or whatever, Facebook or whatever social media, 10K. I'm like, man, listen, 5K going to the whole team, right? The whole STS. Hey, yo, Manny, what's up? Yo, here go 5K. We're going to do a promotion, right? We're going to do a promotion. Here go 6K, 7K. We're going to do a promotion, right? <laughs> you know what I mean? Whatever the case may be, right? And just keep moving forward, man. Keep moving forward. Keep pushing forward. Um, and, and no, right? Even though sometimes you work in, you, you know, you gotta go to a job and stuff like that, them people are not for you, right? They're thinking about themselves. So people, some a lot of people take pride in their job and this and that, and they wanna be a boss, but you're not. You're not until you sign that dotted line, until you create that LLC, until you get that IDO number, until you join a business, until you do a joint venture, until you start cooking and have your meals out there, until you start, start it right? Break that paradigm, right? Break that programming, right? Because I'm protected, you know, and, and, you, and you guys are as well. We are secure. People don't understand though. People don't understand the, uh, the, whole, the whole thing, right? They're still programmed to be bearish. And the more you try to talk to them, the more you try to get them in the business, right? And it's always prospects or, you know, people that you really care about, right? But that's how the, the enemies work, right? Right? And I'm not even gonna say enemies. I'm gonna say enemies. Uh, I, I, I uh, transmute that into something greater um, on a positive side for me, for you guys, for each other. Um, but that's how the system works, right? It's never, they never go for someone that you don't love, right? It's like the villains, right? The villains don't go for, you know, the other villains, no. They go for the old lady. They go for the old man. They go for the kids. They go for, you know, the women in your life. They go to the ones that you love and, you know, they jump inside that person, right? And it's like demonic shit but we not scared of demonic shit. Cause as my boy, right? And it's not a paid advertisement. As my boy, uh, what's the rapper name? Um, uh, Lil TJ, 
I got black, I got white, would you uh have I been a phantom? Have I been a oh yeah, have I been a ghost? Have I been a phantom? I know I'm about to blow. How you done? <laughs> I mean, and that's really what it is, right? That's really what it is, right? So we ain't we listen, we we go with all that. We we go with all that spooky, uh that spooky hocus pocus, all that stuff. We're good off that. We're not scared of that. We're not scared of that. It's a war on poverty. We ain't even scared of being broke no more because we've been there. We did that, right? We want something greater. We want something good or we want something better, right? So peace, love, and light to each and every one of you, to myself as well. Um, we all are secure. We all becoming greater, greater, and greater, and gooder, and gooder, and gooder, right? So peace, love, and light. Uh, we are secure. This call, this whole call was secure, is secure, it's being secure. <laughs> and yeah it's great <laughs> so let's go let's go i'm gonna end this here love you all and i see you next week on the tune up saturday at 9 30 stay active in the chats um because i know it's a lot of things going down the pipeline bitcoin has fell has risen has fell has risen listen this whole week has literally been in consolidation slash falling um so um it should be rising very, very soon. So we should be getting a notification if you're in the DCX platform um, or if you have people that's in DCX and they send you signals and stuff like that, um, you should be receiving something very, very soon. I know Amanda sent something out, but she's she's on these markets crazy um, <laughs> on the nuts. Um, you know, I, 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 I kind of took a step back from, you know, being super crazy on it because I literally just look at charts all day and be like, man, <laughs> the cycle with it. Wow, seriously, seriously. Man, I had to take a step back. The more and more I look at them, the more and more I mend them, the more and more I worry about them, the more else I was taking. Um, and, you know, I will, you know, so I just step back. I just wait for the things to come. If I see something that fits my uh, strategy, uh, my everly growing, greater, you know, profiting strategy, um, then I'll, I'll get into something. But I'm not going to force the, the charts to, to fit my strategy because I'll be taking L's that way, big L's, and I don't got time, <laughs> right? So love you all. Let's go. We found, we bought some. We're great. We're protected. We're secure. All that greatness. And yeah, peace, love, light. <laughs>